came within seven points. Um, you know, then luckily our offense scores, and uh, you know it's a fourth quarter, about six minutes left. And I'm like, all right, Will Andrews, you know, get us, get yourself a series. Um, you know, then then you know our offense throws a pick, they go down to score. It's just just the sudden change, you know. It was just kind of you know an up and down game like that. But um, like I said, I mean, being here as long as I have. You know, you, you, you just take your W's when you can get them, however you can get them. Um, you know, they're too hard to come across, so. Were you tired? Oh, absolutely, yeah. I played every single snap. Yeah, I was definitely tired. Do you think that's just the way it's going to be with you guys, you know, all season, everything down to the... I guess. I mean, I mean, I hope not, you know. Uh, you know, I hope that, you know, we can... You know, blow some teams out, but um, you know, I mean, we're four and one right now. Um, as ugly as it's looked, um, you know, Arizona's one and four. Right. You know, and there's so many teams around the country that would give anything to be four and one going into a bye week. Um, so we're doing great. You know, um, we got to rest up. We got to get healthy this bye week, and you know, go into Northern, Northern California and kick Cal's butt. That's um. It. Is it? Can you? Do you ever? Pull, you have the option of pulling yourself out if you're tired, or they just tell you you're well, staying in, or how does that work exactly? No, I mean, you know, most of it's me just kind of sucking it up. I, I mean, if I, if I needed to get a blow, I, we could always put someone else in there. Um, you know, if my uh, fatigue was ever affecting my performance, then yeah, you'd want to pull yourself out and you know get a blow real quick. Um, you know, but when it comes down to the situations, you know, where I'm about to pull myself out, well, then we go into a two-minute situation at the end of the game. I mean, there's no point. You know, you, but at that point, you just got to suck it up and finish the game. So. Were, were you on the field there at the end for the outside kick? Were you on the hands? Yeah, I'm on the, I'm on the hands. Oh, I got the best hands on the team. Right? So, you know? so what were you thinking when you're out there? I mean, you know, they get the ball. What's going through your mind at that point? Uh, that's the situation, you know, when you're on that hands team, um, you got to have a lot of savvy. You got to be a guy that can think um, on its toes, and uh, you know you just got to play the ball. You can't let the ball play you. You know you got to. Uh, they they their uh, Arizona is uh, infamous for their their shifty onside kick formations. They had one that was which was an awesome scheme. Uh, their onside kick that they had against us today, but um, you know obviously our KOR hand team was just a little better. Um, so TJ made a great play, and you know that's that's a play where it's a it's a you know must-have situation right there. You got to make a play. Sort of get the feeling that TJ wanted to redeem himself today after all those you know personal foul penalties, whether they were legitimate or not, last week. Uh, yeah, I mean, you know, TJ played his butt off. Two picks in the first quarter, obviously, um, which was uh, I think half of the amount that he had all last season in, in one quarter. So. Um, yeah, yeah, more, more than half. So, uh, no, he played well. Um, you know, to be a cover two safety and you know just kind of be uh, limited to uh, a third of the field the whole game. You know, he was very active. He you know made a whole bunch of tackles, made great plays. So.